Scotland has produced many great entertainers in its time. We have now the latest star to be born just over the border. First Royal Variety Show for... Good, good luck to you, mate. Andy Stewart! Come on, then! <laughs> Just come down from the Isle of Skye, I'm no very big and I'm awful shy and the last is shout. When I go by here, Donald, where's your trousers? Let the wind blow high, let the wind blow low, through the streets and make it better go. Oh, all the last is say hello, Donald, where's your trousers? Oh, last it took me to a ball and it was slippery in the hall and I was feared that I would fall, but I had me on my trousers. Let the wind blow high, let the wind blow low. Through the streets in McGill go, all the ladies say hello, down at Welsh and throws Now I once went down to a London town and I had some fun in the underground. The ladies turned their heads around, saying, Donald, where are your trousers? Let the wind blow high, let the wind blow low. Through the streets in McGill go, all the lasses say hello, down at Welsh and throws well, that's the way we sing the song in Scotland, but probably nowadays it would have more international appeal songs, something like this. One, two, three, four. Well, no, just come down from the other sky, and I'm no way to get them off her shy and the last she shot. Well, I'll go by head now. Oh, well, do that. Hello, in the high, hello, in the low. Oh, will you do that? Well, man, I got a rock and roll. I got a movement and a movement to see my soul. Grab me till I go, go, go. No, no. Oh, will you do that? Oh, will you do that? No, no. Just a minute, man. What do you think you're doing, man? I'm rocking it, man. Man, I'm really moving this old Scotch tune. I will just you stop moving this old Scotch tune. It should be sung exactly like this. Ah, yes, come down from the Isle of Sky. I'm no very big and I'm awful shy. And the lassies shout when I go by. Donald, where's your trousers? Let the wind blow high, let the wind blow low. Through the streets and begin to go. Ah, the lassies say hello. Donald, where's your trousers? Donald, where's your trousers? Thank you very much. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. May I say how very thrilled I am to be here this evening. I'm also very nervous because this is my first time abroad. <laughs> I knew I was going to be abroad, so I decided to feel at home I would wear the kilt. And I, I do feel at home in the kilt, and I'm very, very glad to know that the wind has dropped down south. We have a, another song in Scotland which goes something like, The Highlandman, he wears the kilt, and when the wind is blowing, he doesn't know where the wind comes from, but he sure knows where it's going. <laughs> And uh, I've got, m most uh, people in England are very interested, I, I wear the kilt, and uh, this, is, uh, this is the tartan of my clan, I belong to the Stuart clan. Of course, I'm not the only gentleman in the show who belongs to a clan, but I don't think there's a Sinatra tartan. <laughs> I, uh, I come from a, a town which is uh, not very far away from the very famous city of Aberdeen, and if I do one thing in London, I want to dispel this rumor that the people who live in Aberdeen are mean. There's not a word of truth in this. This is a very bad rumor. It actually was spread by the people who live in Aberdeen themselves, just in case anybody wanted to borrow money from them. <laughs> we have the classic example of the two old Aberdonians walking down Union Street. One morning, one turned round to the other. He says, they tell me that Jordy McNabb left 10,000 pounds. His friend says, Jordy McNabb didn't leave 10,000 pounds. He was taken away from it. <laughs> However, be that as it may, I'd like to sing for you now another song. This is a song which I've been very happy to be associated with. It's a song called A Scottish Soldier.
was a soldier, a Scottish soldier, who wandered far away, and soldiered far away. There was none bolder, with good broad shoulder, he'd fought in money a fray, and fought and won. He'd seen the glory, he told the story, of battles glorious, and deeds victorious. But now he's sighing, his heart is crying, to leave those green hills of Tyrol. Because those green hills are not Highland hills, or the island hills, they're not Mylands hills, and fair as these green foreign hills may be, they are not the hills of a This soldier, this Scottish soldier, who wandered far away, and soldiered far away, since the leaves are falling, and death is calling, and he will fade away in that far land. He called his piper, his trusty piper, and bar him soundly, a fever of sad to play upon a hillside, but Scottish hillside, not on those green hills of Tyrol. Because those green hills are not Highland hills, or the island hills, they're not Mylands hills, and fair as these green foreign hills may be, they are not the hills of old. And now this soldier, this Scottish soldier, will wander far no more, and soldier far no more, and on a hillside, a Scottish hillside, you'll see a piper play his soldier home. He's seen the glory, he's told the story of battles glorious and deep victorious. The bugle cease now, he is our peace now, far from those green hills of Tyrol. Because those green hills are not Highland hills, or the island hills, they're not Mylands hills, and fair as these green foreign hills may be, they are not the hills of home. Oh no, those green hills are not Highland hills, or the island hills, they're not Mylands hills, and fair as these green foreign hills may be, they